In this work, we present photocatalytic hydrogen generation using graffiti carbonitride and alkaline metal based aluminates, being uh, barium aluminate or magnesium aluminate. And so to carry out this work, we first uh, synthesized graffiti carbonitride by pyrolysis using urea or theourea at 550 degrees Celsius for three hours. We carried out various characterization techniques to learn about the properties of our material and also carried out the hydrogen evolution reaction using this material as a photocatalyst with triethanolamine as the sacrificial agent. The other type of material that we prepared were, was the alkaline metal based aluminate, in this case being barium aluminate or magnesium aluminate, which were prepared by combustion synthesis at 600 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes to produce white powders that were then annealed at distinct temperatures under distinct uh, heat treatment atmospheres, that being carbon or air. We also evaluated this material using triethanolamide. This was the setup that we used to carry out the experiments. In the center, you can see we have our reactor that contains the photocatalyst mixed with deionized water. Apart from the UV lamp that was used uh, as a light source, we also carried out experiments using visible light. The visible light was uh, acquired from lead strips that were spiraled around the reactor as shown in the following images above. We had a higher, a high result, a high evol hydrogen evolution rate of 97 micromoles per gram of photocatalyst per hour using magnesium aluminate that was calcined in a carbon atmosphere. And the superior result was actually observed using graphitic carbon nitride. We achieved a high rate of 1,622 micromoles per gram of hydrogen, of, of per gram of uh, photocatalyst per hour using the theourea derived graphitic carbon nitride under uh, UV light, which uh, was our best result uh, under these conditions. Thank you for, for your time.